Your Excellency, uh, Deputy Minister Pilic, uh, dear colleagues, uh, I will start in English, but I will, with your permission, continue in English. Uh, I uh, want to emphasize in this introductory speech because I will have privilege and I think I'm thankful for that to uh, speak later as well but uh, in this uh, opening remarks I would like to point to the fact that there is certain business compatibility that uh, mediation has above most of the ADR and the classical litigation approaches. I think that mediation might be called ADR method, but it actually, when you look at it from the business perspective, has a stronger, a stronger advantage. I will explain this, but let me say that uh, while I understand the frustration of those who think that Croatia uh, still does not have enough mediations, which it doesn't, I personally think that over the 10 years that I have seen the development here, uh, it almost looks like science fiction to me. You know, if I think what I could have expected 10 years ago and what we have now on the ground, it is certainly more than I have hoped for. Therefore, we do have reasons to, to be satisfied, as the Deputy Minister Village uh, pointed out. And this process is continuing. I will, in my next speech, show a little bit this time span from the past into the future of mediation locally and globally. Because I draw on my experience as the immediate past uh, chair of the ADR Committee at the International Trademark Association, which is one huge organization <laughs> devoted to the uh, trademark law, but is a strong proponent of IP. And I had the privilege to work with the biggest businesses in the world, such as David's and, and many, many others, who support mediation. I have been uh, to the invited to a, a, a global summit council of one multinational company, where I have heard uh, head of, of IP for that global concern telling law firms, there were hundred law firms there from all over the world, either you recommend me first mediations and interest-based solutions, or I'm taking my business away. So this is what David has put mildly, you know, when you hear that being told to the lawyers, is is rather powerful for the lawyer to have a privilege to hear that not being on the side of those who are told to change. And this is the reason why Bacon McKenzie, why Alan and Albury introduced very early, uh, they recognized this paradigm change that, that, that was going on. Why the business is like it? I said I will I will a little bit explain that. And that is primarily because of that compatibility, you manage your risk probably in the first place. So the managers hate the risk. I mean, <coughs> the risk uh, of doing business on modern markets is so big already that any quantum that you can uh, diminish is something that is that is crucial. And uh, and the really a mediation, you retain control of the outcome. And, and if you know that this is coupled with the 80% uh, uh, likelihood that you will resolve uh, at least part of your problem, uh, you go for it. The cost is incomparable. And although my students are often surprised to hear that the commercial mediation can cost 50,000 uh, euro or 80,000 euro, you know, compared to the million or couple of million, that is much, much less. And of course, in Croatia, it will unfortunately not quickly cost 50,000 because that would be good for mediators, certainly, but our economy cannot bear it. But, but uh, the relative size of the cost compared to the litigation is just uncomparable. And business is like that. And then, if you do business in frictionless economy, any amount of friction that you can diminish again is, is important. And you uh, strive to uh, maintain business relations because some research shows that uh, losing the business relation and then replacing it with a new one costs more than repairing the old one. So again, in business terms, it, it makes sense. Um, I have seen two things, uh, and that brings me to a conclusion of what I want to share with you now, is I saw so two things that businesses are powerful driving forces for the introduction of mediation. 
And that is in developing economies. Therefore, the way that Croatia chose to do, introducing it through court annex mediation, makes a lot of sense. Because our economy does not have this demand in, 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 in the sense of start, start mediation. Let's, let's, let's do it. Uh, so we created uh, 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 these mechanisms on the strength of this uh, judicially driven uh, court annex mediation. But the time has come to change. And now there is a hiatus in which this frustration builds up, in my view, before the economy picks up. And this is why I think that this event is so important. And I hope there will be more events like that. Mediation needs to be understood by management. It's a strategic importance. It's not legal department who will decide whether a business will be mediated. So we need to speak to the top management and, and to the management managers in order to create a, a situation in which uh, in-house counsel can uh, divert <coughs> cases uh, to mediation. And uh, to conclude, I want to say that in my view, uh, mediation uh, does not have the future that we all imagine. Uh, in terms of big number of mediation sessions or something. What I see is a paradigmatic change in society. This change already occurred. That gives me confidence to predict uh, so you know, um, loudly that, uh, that the, the, the change already occurred. Disputants are prepared in modern societies to take responsibility for their disputes. It is about taking or giving responsibility back to the people who created the disputes. And uh, because of that, it will not stop only there with the assistance of mediators. It will become a ubiquitous uh, process. Because when you train kids to, for, to peer medi in, in peer mediation at, at the kindergarten level, at the elementary school, once they take more classes and learn communication techniques, then you have a society that prevents disputes from happening all of the time. Fortunately, I don't have more time to elaborate on this, but I'll leave you with that thought. Thank you very much. <laughs>